What is up guys? We are back with some more Pokemon Sword and we're here with Hop and he just asked for one more battle. Thanks, Blades. Then show me the strength that defeated Lee, the greatest champion we ever had. I'm ready when you are, so just say the word. Okay, I think for once I'm gonna start off with uh I'm gonna start off with Rillaboom. Just because I have that fighting move on him. I don't think he's going to switch up his team. This will be a serious battle. You ready for that, aren't you? Of course. This is it. Yeah, now he's acting more and more like his brother. Thing, bro. I'm not even mad. Wow, that actually did really increase his defense a lot. Okay, you kind of screwed yourself over there with that, though. If he sends out Snorlax, it's Toxtricity's turn. Oh, Corviknight. Well, it could still be Toxtricity's turn. Keeping you out of here because even though Snorlax might know Earthquake now, I can just put Toxic on him. And that was my plan from the get go. High horsepower, okay, that's another chicken kind of move. But I did what I needed to do. Okay, so we took out Toxtricity, so... Um, maybe this will be my chance to switch into Dragapult and <laughs> for once maybe showcase his ability. I don't know if his Snorlax knows Crunch, though. I don't know, this Dragon Dance. I feel really bad if... You know, Snorlax just obliterates Dragapult now. Yep, he knows Crunch. <laughs> that gives me a good setup for you, man. And since he's gonna use a dark move, I might as well just send out Grim Snow. Actually might be my chance to to revive Toxtricity. I want him to get the XP, which we'll be facing in the future. Oh, 
Holy crap. Bulldoze. I still wish I had um earthquake form, but I don't. Also, I don't, I don't know which Pokemon this is. <laughs> oh wow, I sent out like the worst Pokemon. Italian doesn't outspeed us. Bug move. It's a double takeout. <laughs> or a knockout. That's why that man I'm hungry. I said takeout. I feel like that was the best way to go out. It was just both fainting with our starters. I didn't expect that it'd be such a gap between you and me, mate. So there really is no way I could ever beat you. I mean, you can beat my unbeatable brother. And if it isn't the two of you again, I was wondering what all that noise was about. And if it isn't Sonya. Blades, congratulations on beating Leon. Taking it all in stride like it's yours do, huh? You cheeky thing. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be off assisting the professor? Hop, I'm actually not working as my grand's assistant any longer. In fact, I'm the professor now. Y you are? And really, I've got the two of you to thank for that. I was just along for the ride on your adventure, but I ended up taking a real interest in the history of the Gala region, and I came to care for Pokemon even more than I ever had before. Ah, here, it's a book I wrote. I even signed it. That makes it a collector's item.
I've already got my own copy lined up to buy it on the day it comes out. So if that's so sweet, I'll sign your copy for you later. Anyway, I've got my grand's blessing and put out my first book under my own name. I think you can expect great things of the lovely Professor Sonya in the future, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I expect so. Sonya and Blades, you both amaze me. I've got a lot to live up to here. So, what are you doing? What are you youngins doing here? Oh, uh, right. Oh, that's it, isn't it? You were putting the rusted sword and rusted shield back in their place. You can't just keep holding on to them forever, right? We were. Yeah, that's what we were doing. We were just about to do that. <laughs> you forgot entirely, didn't you? What? You think the two of you are besties now with Zacian and Zamazenta or something? That must be it, Blaze. Why you felt like you were called here? Let's put the sword and shield back and say a proper thanks for all their help. Maybe if we do, we'll get to see Zacian and Zamazenta again someday. Yes, let's return the rusted sword. Zacian and Zamazenta, thanks loads for helping us out. It took us a little while, but we brought back your precious relics and all. You and Hop return the rusted sword and a rusted shield. Alright, that about settles that, Blades. Why don't you and I head back? What are you going to do, Sonya? I think I'll stay here a bit longer. I want to do a little more research here in the forest. Hmm. My power spot detector is going off. Well, 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 I thought I heard someone making some noise over this way. Wait, who? What's up with the haircuts? What? Well, 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 you wouldn't be the Professor Sonya who wrote the book Gather a History? Ah, hello, bought my book? Why, yes, of course, read it from cover to cover. Why, yes, of course, I even wrote an internet review for it. That awful book was filled with lies, so we gave it one star. What? There are no lies printed in that book. That's just plain read. I am Swordward. I am Shilbert. We're the new kings of Galar. We're descendants of the first kings. More than that, we're celebrities. New kings? Descendants? Seriously, what are you on about? What exactly are you two supposed to be? Well, well, well. Could these things be here the fabled sword and shield? Well, well, they certainly are dirty. They must be a fake. I feared to touch them with my bare hands. Oh, snap. They're stealing the, the relics. Hey, don't be nicking those, we just returned them. Oh, do shut up. We only happened to pick up some things that were dropped on the ground. If you got a problem with it, how about you prove to whom they belong? Hmm? But there's no way anyone can prove who those ancient things belong to. Even if we can't prove it, they're really important to Zacian and Zamazenta. Oh goodness, such a plebeian, and yet so plushy. If it's pushy, if it's really so important to you, perhaps we should settle this with the battle. We're celebrities who buy battles for twice what they're worth. What does that even mean? I, the Magnificent Swordward, am your opponent. Okay, was not expecting this, but he has a luxury ball. Is my, my team's not even healed up, are they? No. Hopefully we outspeed. Yep. <laughs> one HP left. <laughs> It'd be funny if all he had was like Surfresh, but he might just have like sword based teams. Uh, yeah, he's Ghost Steel. So yeah, I think we'll, I think we have speed. Oh man, we didn't have speed. Oh, well that worked out. Uh, Bisharp. 
That's dark steel. Oh no, now I wish I healed up my team. So I do want them to get EXP. Another revive, probably max potion or full restore, and then I'll work on marking. Or oh, never mind, he's going in for the kill. And he might get a crit too. Oh, clutch. Which is a bug. Who to use? Oh man, I could have totally just used uh, Cold Ossal too and used a rock mode. <laughs> That's enough talking about it. I suppose it's time to get serious. Oh, how can this be? My my Pokemon. I thought you guys were rich. How are you only gonna give me eight thousand? To, to someone who have defeated adorable Pokemon I go strolling with, you're certainly strong. However, it appears that my younger brother was victorious. Sorry, Blades, I lost to him. Wahaha, <laughs> something on your mind, boy? You weren't concentrated at all during our battle. Older brother, isn't that the one who stopped Eternatus? Oh, now I look closely, I believe it is. What a rude child, snatching up our chance, according to our sources. I believe he was also present during the destruction of the magnificent mural our ancestors so artfully created many years ago. What a garish brute, destroying the mural our family has held in such high esteem for so long. Mural? You mean that one that hit the historical ruins of Zacian and the others? And hold on a moment, Blades wasn't the one who destroyed it. Let us withdraw for now, next time we shall bring Pokemon that will utterly defeat you. That's right, and with that, farewell. Wait, stop, get back that rusted shield. Hold on, Hop. Uh, that kid, he's gone and recklessly run off. At least you're calm, Blades. I expected as much. I'm surprised that Hop lost to someone like that. He looked upset about something during the battle. Maybe it had something to do with it. His own rival became the new champion and his goal vanished before his eyes. You can't help but wonder how he feels about it all. Anyway, Swordward and Shilbert, was it? I think I might know something about where those two weirdos went. Shall we go over it at the lab in Wedgehurst? I bet I didn't even need to ask. Thanks. Okay, we'll meet up later then. I'll head back to the lab. Wow, this is... This is a lot going on. Let me let me go talk to my mom real quick so she can heal up my team. Uh, who are you? 
Professor Sonya, you have a visitor. Hey, Blaze, glad you're here. Spot on, I've been busy with my research, so I decided to bring on some extra help. I've been keeping all the wishing stars that Chairman Rose has been gathering here in the lab. Things have been a little hectic around here, but my assistant has been handling things in a proper fashion. She's really been helping me keep things afloat. I really haven't been doing all that much. You're Blades the Champion, right? I'm really glad I get to meet you. It's an honor, truly. Come here for a moment, would you? There's something I want you to have a look at. You remember my power spot detector, right? It detects places where dynamaxing is possible. Basically, when there's a high concentration of gather particles, the readings spike. And that's how I figured it out. The power spot detector reacted when those two got close. S could it be? Exactly. Follow the readings from that power spot detector and you might be able to find those sword and shield weirdos. Swordward and Shilbert might claim to be royalty with their weird fancy names, but it's easier to just call them weirdos, don't you think? Let's get back on topic, though. I place power spot detectors all around Gather, and now it's their time to shine. Power spot detectors, access. Okay, what? Oh. Uh. Okay, well now we know where they're at, right? <laughs> it says I can't fly there yet. Whoa, 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 there's a way bigger reaction than I would have thought. Looks like it's coming from Turfield Stadium. You could always Dynamax Pokemon at the stadium, so that's not exactly unusual, but these readings are way higher than normal. It can't be a Tornadoes, you already caught it. Maybe it's something related to those Sword and Shield weirdos. You should go check it out, Blaze, since you're our snazzy new champion and all. I set up your town map to show where the strong particle reactions are coming from, so have a look at it. It's just at Turfield, though, right? It's nowhere else. Yeah. Looks like it's just there at Turfield. But guys, I'm going to end this episode off here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. With that said, stay sharp. Later.